Welcome to Bad Hops. If you'd please subscribe, we would appreciate it. is rocking. The home opener is coming up next. Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Toronto Blue Jays taking on the Baltimore Orioles. Along with my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Schumann. We're going to have a special atmosphere for this one, Singy. These fans have been waiting a long time to get back inside the ballpark and support their favorite team. Yeah, we knew today would be electric, but after their team picked up a few road wins to kick off the year, I think the energy inside this stadium is going to be turned up an extra notch. So let's see if they can keep this good start going here at home. First pitch coming your way next. set to go. Here's Nico Horner. The afternoon for Toronto. The second base Nico Horner. Right-hander kicks deals on the ground. Tosses to first and a quick out number one. Base is empty with two away. Bo Bichette up to the dish. The two one. Up the middle. And that one handled. Whips it to first. And Bichette is retired. They don't come. Now, Max Owens. Not only can he hit the cover off the ball, he's got a great eye as well. The pitch. Tap of the zone, and it's called a strike. Strike two. That's down and in. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten him up a little bit so he doesn't have as much outside plate coverage. Fights that one away. Still one and two. Really great change of speeds. He goes off the off speed to the fastball and the hitter doesn't know what's coming next. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And that's the first out. Very frustrating right there as a... On the ground to first. Guerrero oh. takes it himself. What a play. Bottom of the inning. And into the box for Baltimore. Max out. Second base. The right-hander back to work. And a foul ball. Chris, you played here in 2002. What are the memories that stand out as to being a member of the Baltimore Orioles? For me, it was just pulling into the parking lot and having those that were there with a, an encouraging smile or a pat on the back, regardless of how things were going, it made it a lot easier to come to the ballpark, whether you were doing well or you were struggling. And then the way that they treated your family. I mean, this is a great place to play. And I'd say it's got to be one of the top places in all of baseball. Perfect example right there. A hitter who hits the ball on the outside part of the plate the other way has to trust his hands and let the ball travel a little bit deeper. And now it's Austin Hayes. The pitch. That's in there. That is strike two. Activity in the bullpen. Eric Swanson appears to be getting loose. Karen check. Warming up as well. Runner on the move. Ball outside. Proceed. That's a stolen base. Swing and a miss. 
Couldn't catch up to the heater. Came inside with that two-strike fastball nicely and just bunched him up on the inside part of the plate. Couldn't get around on it and catch it out front. Many times if you do, it's a foul ball. And you know a lot of pitchers, they really don't like working inside with two strikes because they do not want to hit that batter. And when they've got him up against the ropes, got to figure out a way to put him away. Did a nice job right there. That one misses. And the count is three and one. And you had a cameo in the movie Moneyball as an Orioles player in a highlight clip. And there's ball four. I don't think he really wanted to pitch to him right there anyhow. First and second one out. And now it's Alex Bregman. Here comes a pitch. And that's downstairs and outside. Rip to third and caught to first, but he's back in time. Nice hustle to avoid the double play there. So first and second with two outs. Gunnar Henderson, the next to hit for the Orioles. Righty delivers. That one the other way, and it stays fair. Powers rounds third, headed for the plate. He scores, and they lead by two. And that's a two-out double. Tag, and he's out at the play. That ends the inning. Bottom of the eighth. Here's the Orioles' leadoff hitter, Max Powers. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that can steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? And he deals. And a good eye there. When you have a real athletic player and who's able to do the baseball mechanical things really well, look out because the sky's the limit on that potential. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Foul ball. One, two now. Fouls that off to the left, and we'll do it again. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a stolen base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. The one, two. And a foul ball, he stays alive. All right, come on now, one time, let it fly. Righty to the plate. Fouls it off, still one and two. Right-handed reliever. Swings and misses, it's a strikeout. And him out front for strike three. That's a pretty nasty pitch right no, there. No. I'd call it a power no, curveball in the 80s. Well, they win the opener at home. First game of the three-game series. And there's just such a good feeling when you're in your own ballpark. You're sleeping in your own bed. You're eating your clubhouse manager's food. Everything's right in your world. And they played like it today. Bad Hops Baseball. Smash that like button.